as somebody who grew up in rural i know the pain of fetching the water from the river where you share the same water with pigs we started manufacturing steel tanks back in 98. SBS offer an alternative to concrete. In concrete, the community will have to wait for months before they can start even testing the tank if it can hold the water or not. It takes six to eight weeks to have a water structure standing. On completion of installation, the community can start having water. Very often the site is at the top of a hill and if we can get a bucky up to the site, we can build a tank. Whether it be our little four panel, 15, 20 kiloliter job or a 3.3 million liter, we've built them right at the top of hills. We build our tanks from the top upward and then we use hand jacking mechanisms. No heavy cranes, no other sort of lifting gear and we can run from generators with all the level of equipment we use. We introduced the zinc coating, being the combination of aluminium and zinc. Our tank components made up of four basic components, being your concrete ring beam, being the foundation, the tank body, your roof cover, and the most important part is the liner. The liner keeps the water from being in direct contact with the steel. You put clean water in, you're gonna get clean water out. It's holding our precious resource. Municipalities trust us because of the after-sale services we provide. We offer a 10-year leak-free warranty on the product. If there is a challenge, we will make sure that we sort out the challenge with the customer. A community must not walk more than 200 meters to fetch water. We've got in-house project managers to make sure that the project is completed within time, within the budget. The traditional way needed a lot of time and money. And nowadays, that are the two things we're lacking. We offer solutions. And nowadays, the solution is water. We need water. So it really pleases me to see us making a change to those communities. It provides the service that really touches people's lives because without water, there's no life. <laughs>